hit it has now hit double digits going into Bill, the Bill, I apologize. Stress. Stay with me. We've got to go quickly to New Hampshire. Okay. Duncan Hunter making that announcement. We believe he is possibly stepping out of the race. Person running, Democrat or Republican, who has actually chaired a major security committee. And I could have provided lots of good information in the ABC and Fox debates when they talked about the, the nuclear weapons development uh, in places like Iran and the, uh, and the Pakistan Strip uh, situation with respect to Afghanistan and, of course, the troop rotations uh, that are taking place in Iraq. I was not there to give my position and, and take my, my part in that debate. Uh, some knucklehead executive in ABC uh, closed me out. And uh, similarly, Fox News decided not to allow me to take place in the Fox News debate on Sunday. And you know, in the interim between making that initial decision and the debates, something took place. It was called the Wyoming Caucuses. And in the Wyoming Caucus, I won a delegate. In fact, I now have a, an officially declared delegate. And as I understand the rules, uh, that means that guys like John McCain, who have zero delegates, and uh, Rudy Giuliani, who have zero delegates, were allowed to attend these two debates. But a guy who actually had some points on the scoreboard, that was myself, was not allowed to attend the debates uh, because some knucklehead, arrogant executive in the corporate media world of ABC and Fox News in some third or fourth story glass office decided that I was my campaign was over and the lights were going to be shut out on my campaign. So against that backdrop, uh, ABC and Fox have been asking uh, us when I'm going to quit. So here's my answer. I'm not going to quit. I'm going to continue. Well, that was I'm the complete win. opposite of what I think everybody else uh, was expecting. I think the feeling was that Duncan Hunter was going to make this major announcement that he was going to drop out of the uh, presidential race, but indeed he's not uh, holding back, uh, not holding back, uh, ripping apart um, executives at ABC News and Fox News, saying uh, that uh, th those individuals made the decision not to let him participate in the debates, uh, therefore uh, trying to push him out of the presidential race or having any standing there. Bill Schneider, you and I were talking polls. Uh, this is probably a little bit more exciting uh, for, for us to talk about right now. Um, what's your take on the fact that he's slamming these executives and uh, saying he's not going to back out, he's staying in the race? Well, my immediate response, perhaps emotional, is good for him. Let him <laughs> stay in the race, let the voters decide. You know, it's always difficult when you have these debates because uh, the uh, people who sponsor the debates, whether it's a network or an organization, want to include everyone who's viable. They don't want a crowded stage full of candidates uh, who are just fringe candidates. And, you know, on the New Hampshire ballot, sometimes there are hundreds and hundreds of candidates. All you can do, all you need to do is pay $1,000 to get your name on the ballot. On the other hand, you know, the, 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 the executives say you have to show us you're viable to be included, but their argument is well, if you don't include me in the debate, I can't become viable. So it's kind of circular reasoning here. Uh, nevertheless, he's going to stay in. He's going to leave it up to the voters. And I say that's the way it should be. And, Bill, if you've got the money, you can stay in, right? Yes. I mean, that's all it takes. That's right. He has the money and he has an issue. You know, since Tom Tangredo got out of the race, he's one of the leading uh, Republican spokespersons uh, for the, on the issue of illegal immigration. They all have something to say about it, but he claims that he's got a record on illegal immigration. He represents a San Diego congressional district near the Mexican border. And if there's going to be a, a protest vote on illegal immigration, it could go to him. Let the voters decide. All right, Bill Schneider, thanks so much. Uh, Duncan Hunter uh, staying in the presidential race. California Congressman mincing no words there about how he feels about ABC News and Fox News for uh, not letting him participate in the debates there. So he's sticking it out. We're going to follow it.